Uh, kind of the cool colored uh, cross guild here in the mid middle of the pen. 39-4, be wide awake, Steel Town. Yeah, another one of those deals. And man, this uh, Steel Town stuff is just coming out stamped very familiar and in terms of uh, just skull and, and form and bone and then boldness of rib shape. You know, I think I think that uh, that Sal has brought a lot of that to the table and then Wide Awake has definitely helped with it as well too. And so it's been a, been a cool combination on all of these all these pigs we've seen so far in that litter. This guild brings all that those pieces we talked about, just mug shape and, and, and stoutness of skull and then big, big giant forearm with a lot of hair and a big rib cage and four rib that that's laid into that. And I think uh, about this guilt, what's kind of interesting is or more unique is that her hind leg just works so dang good. It's so flexible and bendy and correct. And so you've got that cool parts and pieces up front combined with a really, really square productive hind leg that reaches and goes. And uh, there's a lot of potential here. Yeah, 39-4, uh, again, uh, we'll get, uh, uh, you can kind of see everything Jake's talking about just uh, by just moving around the ring. Uh, that one's uh, hip and hind leg, uh, I think, uh, exactly as he said, is uh, very, very, very good. She's hairy, she's good in her bone, she's strong in terms of uh, just her foot set, her shape. She has good body cavity and good turn to her rib cage with a neat look out of the front end of her skeleton. Uh, I think that's just a very high quality type of uh, show gale, a nice sow, uh, could be a good sow prospect as well. I think very dope purpose this is 39-4 crossbred guilt 